Hello friends, welcome to LMS Solution Research Support. In this video, we are going to discuss about latest updated AAPRM chat GPT prompts. So these prompts will blow your mind. Please make a note of it. It will be very, very useful for our research, uh, research article preparation. So let us go for today's video and explore what are the important latest updated chat GPT prompts. So just you can open chat GPT. So here type that literature review literature reviews thesis and we'll be getting getting the prompt yes this this is the prompt literature uh, reviews thesis and academic articles just to click on that so here what i am going to do is i am going to copy and paste a particular topic or title so here I am going to paste a common title so you can give your own title related with your research work or else you can give the area where you are working where you have started the working for the budding researchers so you can copy and paste here and click this prompt let us see how it will generate the literature review for that particular content So here you can see the literature review for the particular content is generated. So you, you can see here the integration of renewable energy sources in power system has gained. So like that it will generate content. It will generate the citations also for that particular uh, topic, particular paper. So let us explore another uh, title with the same prompt. So I am going to click here. So grid connected. <laughs> So I am going to click type grid connected solar PV system for inter for electric vehicle charging station. So like that I am going to give a title here. So you can see click the enter. So let us see how it will generate for that particular title. So here you can see it will generate uh, introduction for that particular uh, title you have given. So that is paragraph one. So here you can see the uh, citations for that particular literature survey. So click on continue generating. Yes, with the references it has generated the content. So here you can see around one, two, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 different references related with that particular topic is generated. So this makes your literature survey writing very very easier. You can, uh, no need to worry about it. You can write it easily using this kind of prompt, using this prompt. So you, you will be getting the introduction part of your research paper very very easily using this prompt. So this is a fantastic uh, that is a uh, idea of creating your introduction part of your lit uh, literature paper with the references see so here you can see the references 2021 19 16 19 20 uh, 17 18 18 uh, then 22 so you'll be getting the references which is very uh, closer that is the recent papers only it will given so that is also an important option in some other a tools that it will generate a old paper as a references also so here you can use this kind of prompt to write your introduction part of your research paper very very easier so this is the fantastic aaprm prompts please take a note of it so next one next prompt what we are going to discuss is is that code generator so code just type on that search generator so click on the code generator so for example uh, there are many optimization algorithms are put forth for uh, partial shading in solar pv system so are, are, are used as an mppt technique in a solar pv system so for that i am going to give a prompt generate code for gray wolf optimization algorithm so it is one of the algorithm which can be useful for user for our uh, maximum power point tracking generate a here you have give the software generate a 
matlab code that is very important you have to mention tuition algorithm for maximum power point tracking so like that you can give a prompt so let us see how it will generate matlab code for that particular section so you will be seeing here yes it is started to generate so as uh, gray wolf optimization always proposes three different things that is alpha beta and gamma so here it is generated so here you can see the matlab code is generated for that uh, particular code you have given so you can copy and paste your matlab file and you can try simulation and if it if the, if the error persists you can ask for the error also in the same code generator so like that you can make use of this option to generate a technical code in any softwares where you can make your uh, work that is research work very very easier using this prompt so this is a fantastic option you will be getting so next prompt what we are going to discuss today is that just a minute so type on content specialist writer so make a note of this this one also this is a fantastic one content specialist writer so click on that so it's the best content writer with humanized text so what i am going to give is generate an abstract for the title so i am going to uh, type the same title grid connected solar pv system for electric vehicle charging station so i am going to click enter so let us see how it will generate uh, that particular brief human written content for that particular so it will generate a detailed content regarding that particular topic so you can make use of the option to uh, that is you can make use of this option that is you can just give title don't no need to give abstract and all so here you can see this is a brief uh, explanation of the particular topic will be giving so you can make use of this option to create a unique content uh, for your uh, research article so next one is uh, next important prompt is that unique content with semantic so here, here you will be getting you mean unique content with semantic keyword so here you can give uh, same topic here so grid connected solar pv system for electric vehicle charging station so like that you can give the input prompt here so and give, give enter so here you will be getting a content like this here so you can see the section outline unique section outline for the particular title so first you can see here section one deals with the so it is generating it will take several seconds introduction so here you can see topics ideations entities to use so uh, so keywords variant so like that it will generate uh, section wise keywords where you will be very very useful for your thesis preparation so you can make use of the for example if you are preparing a thesis you have to separate the chapters you are working to different chapters so in, in every chapter you need yes uh, you need important keywords for the particular uh, chapter point of view so thereby you can make use of this option to generate a better uh, that is keyword related with that particular chapter also so this is also a fantastic option available in this prompt so these are the four important prompts which is very very useful for our research latest update uh, aaprm chat gpt prompts so here you can see the first prompt we have discussed is literature review thesis and academic art articles this is a fantastic prompt where you can make use of this to save your time in research writing so hope this video will be very helpful for you for the researchers so thank you for watching our videos have a nice day thank you